Now, unprecedented protests have erupted across major cities in China, including Beijing and Shanghai, where hundreds gathered in an outpouring of public anger against the government's COVID-19 lockdown rules. Our Kim yo Sun has more. Protests are growing in China with people calling for freedom, democratic reforms, as well as an end to COVID-19 lockdown rules. Hundreds of people took to the streets in Beijing and Shanghai on Sunday, even into early Monday, in a very rare outpouring of public anger against the state. Some shouted down with Xi Jinping. Others shouted and lockdowns all over the country. I think we need to identify close or semi-close contacts, people who might be infected. We don't need this huge screening of the whole compound. It's not necessary to be so strict. Similar protests were also held in Chengdu, Wuhan and Guangzhou, according to videos shared on social media. The clash between the demonstrators and police escalated as people refused to disperse. The unprecedented wave of civil disobedience first erupted on Friday in Rumuchi, the regional capital of the far west Xinjiang region, as a fire in a residential building killed 10 people a day ago. Witnesses say the residents were not able to evacuate in time because the building was under partial lockdown. The city's 4 million residents have been facing some of the longest lockdowns across China, being unable to leave their homes for as long as 100 days. The Chinese government has stuck with Xi's zero-COVID policy, even when many parts of the world have lifted restrictions. It hails its policies as life-saving and essential to prevent an overload on its national health system. Kim Hyo-san, Arirang News.